Ah, pants on the Star City wall, baby. The fortified wall. And I'm falling down. Take a look at what we're doing. We're turning around. We're going straight up this this steep. I can't even turn around. I gotta stand up. I have my. I'm stuck. It's straight down. I don't know if you can see, but this is the this is the grade right here that I'm on, all the way down. So I know you can't really tell from here looking this way, but if I turn around this way, that's what I'm sitting on. And I'm stuck on top of a dead tree on top of a broken wall. My God. But look what I found. Oh God. Oh. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, this. Oh shit. Look at the. Look at this. What the fuck is this? Are you. What is this? Oh, it has something. It says something on it. It says something on it. Hilux. Hilux. And it has a. Hilux. Hilux. What's Hilux? I don't even know what that is. It has, it has the metal top still on it. The metal top still on it, baby. It was right there. It was stuck in the top of the hill. Top of the wall and it's steep here, baby. Oh, oh, oh shit. <laughs> I almost fell backwards. Oh my god. I need, I need to stop. Okay, there's a bottle top right there. I want to get to that bottle. No, okay, I can leave it. It's too high up. There's a bottle top there. It looks to be a machine top. There's bricks underneath the tree, in under the tree. They're burnt and damaged. Yes, they are, baby. And I can't get. Oh, and this here, this like, what was this? This ashtray plate, whatever this was. Look how beautiful. What was that even? What the? What was that? Look at this beautiful. Every, the texture of the glass, the rainbow tinge is a strong indicator of what you're looking at and look at the beautiful designs on these in this glass and oh come on it's on the top what is i mean there are people who pay money to, to get a site to just to dig and they don't even know what's even there really they don't even know what's there they have small indicators like you know like shards of glass and what have you somebody's been here doing something what's this any little stones in there it's nothing but uh what's well, something it's something this glass turned up in there with the tree roots and these were bricks in rows baby and they are hooked into fucking ash baby i'm sorry but there's the mortar joint right there still so they were bricks you see the mortar's vacated here but here's a mortar joint still between that one it's, it's mortar it's mortar baby yes it is there was the bricks what are they doing there fucking a what are they doing there fucking a I'm a, i almost fell back again What's that, a dinner plate? Okay, so, my goodness, this is straight down. What am I doing? I want you to see this mortar. I want you to see this condition. I want you to see their flat pane, their flat as pain, panes of glass, um, concrete. And I want you to see the, the old world growing in under the trees, baby. In under, what is this hole right here? See, we got, we got critters, you know? Maybe not so many snakes and all that, but you be careful in your area. You might have snakes, you know? You go digging around in this shit like this. You might not want to do this. In your neck of the woods, you might want to go somewhere else. This depends. Um, but I'm running into some weird stuff too over here. I swallowed a bug. I swallowed a gnat and I, I'm telling you, it took a left turn and went straight down my esophagus. I'm telling you, it, it was not done flying yet. Another brick here and it's damaged and melted. And it's damaged and melted. And there's bugs in it. I don't want to bother the bugs. So, this is just straight up and down. I don't know how I'm gonna get back down. Just get my foot on that, and that's about all that's supporting me. I, I climbed up it. I guess I climbed back down it. The slide, slide back. That's all I'm gonna be able to do. Okay. Hi, my foot digs in over here. I'm crunching on glass. I just know I'm crunching bottles and old bottles and what have you, baby. And what have you. And look at the bricks. Oh, I show you a brick I found down over here. It was sitting out here just waiting for me. I found a, Mex a Mexico number one brick. It was called Mexico number one. And I'm on top of a, a little wall here, a little wall addition. I'll show you in a moment. What does this one say? Oh, I should not be standing on here. Look at all these are bricks right here. These are all like prep parts of this wall. But oh, this one had a stamp too. Oh, hello, Mr. Worm. I'll put you back. I'll put you back there. There you go. Well, there you are. There you are, you can get back there. Where are you? Where'd you go? 
I don't know where you went. Oh, okay. There you go. What does this say? Viking, another Viking one. Yep, that's coming with me too. That's coming with me too. It says Viking, and that is coming with me. You gotta be kidding me. All this burnt masonry, all this burnt and charred and damaged. Uh, maybe I should go. This way is easier. There's my brick. Watch this now. That is so steep. These were all bricks here. This whole thing was, this whole wall was all brick. Look at the concrete. Smooth as a baby's bottom and it is, and you ain't kidding. It is, oh. Hang on. See, as I'm coming down this steep hillside, I want you to look before I leave it. I almost left the whole fucking, look at this. This is why I came up here, look at this. Not melted, eh? The mortar bleeding into the block, not melted, eh? And they laid it that way and got it to come out perfect like this still with a crisp straight edge, right? No. They all mishmashed together into one solid material at the bottom. Give me a break. And there's mortar joints inside of the blocks. Inside of the blocks there are mortar joints still because they've blocked, the bricks are blocked up together. I'm coming down the hillside here and all I'm seeing as I'm coming down this steep stuff is I'm, oh, I'm crunching on glass and there's just glass everywhere, bottles and artifacts, you know, and needles, and needles and stuff like this. And then you're grabbing stuff and um, right, right, you gotta be careful, baby. But you're seeing just like mortar joints and bricks and bricks sticking out and it's just unfucking real what, what you find. And that's why I wear the gloves, you gotta be careful, you gotta wear the rubber gloves. The rubber gloves so you don't uh, get you, you know get poked with something like that that's why you just don't go reaching into stuff could get bit by a snake it could get poked by a needle baby and that's just the truth i don't care if it sounds gruesome the pipe right here doesn't rust it doesn't rust just started to rust just started to rust it's part of the damage mex arco viking and a viking so mex arco I found a Mexico number one. It was perfect like this still. It's, this is still a, a heat damaged brick. It's still been vitrified. It's still heat damaged, but it's just, it's from this here. This structure had been using Viking bricks, whatever those are. And now they're pretty much all limestone, but there's a few of these Vikings and stuff left in here, scattered about that I'm finding, like in here and stuff and all this. So these were Viking bricks that made this part of the wall that comes out here. And this, likely this whole thing was made of these bricks too. Why I'm finding so many of these Viking ones. This is the first good one. And this one. But this one's special. Because I keep finding these ones. And it was laying here like this. Waiting for me. It's laying there like that. And then I find that. And I find this. And this fancy, fancy, fancy bottle top. And a, a good, a complete Viking. Complete one. That would be good if I clean it up. But let me show you the wall. What's happening here? There's the original concrete. There's the original rendering right here at the, at the base. Now, you see all these are bricks right here, these rows. You see each one, those are the rows. These are all the, the joints, the mortar joints. Now let's back away and see what happened here. Coming down the rubble. And what is it? Well, oh, there's another good Viking one. See, this whole thing was Viking bricks. This whole thing was Viking bricks. They're all the same. So here's the fortified wall. There's the other section that comes out, like this one here, comes out this way. That one's more intact still. And the whole base, we were seeing the joints down there, remember, we, were, we just saw them in there. But from back here, it's all one solid mass. And up there, they've all blocked up. Or on the pipe, they survived, the bricks, because there was air coming through the pipe. So it would be cooler right there. That's why the bricks around the pipe survive often unlike the rest of the building, which was red hot and glowing, uh, there was air in that pipe, so that would cause a cooling factor around that, that area right there because the air was passing through while the rest of the building was glowing hot, right? So, so the bricks there were surviving. The air was keeping that part of the building cooler just around it. These all, there's the original rendering right there on the outside of the bricks, the concrete, flat, it's a pane of glass. Up there, that's the original up there. All of it is flat as a pane of glass. Even the stuff on the very top, different color. 
it's fused and damaged and melted right into the wall down here and it's, it's damaged more on that side over there. Oh, I don't want to walk over there. But you get the idea, you get the idea. All down here, it's all masonry. It's all masonry coming off the building in old stuff. This wood's probably X-factored wood. It's got old tapered head square heads here, tapered square heads in all this masonry materials coming off of the wall, crumbling down. This is enormous, absolutely enormous. And this, if these blocks were to have been laid this way, those are megalithic. But we can see that they're bricks turning into blocks. There's mortar joints. There's mortar, there's still mortar between the stuff that's blocking up. There's still mortar joints between these. And you see that they're bricks, the same size brick in every row, but they've really blocked up together. You see the same size brick in it, but they've blocked up. You see that the joints are here, but they've all blocked up. And from the bottom up too. The heat came from the bottom, baby. There's a bridge right there. I'll show you in a moment. I'll show you in a moment. Let me grab my artifacts. The artifacts of the day. And see here. Okay. Very, very much melted together and very un unrecognizable. But wait till you see what else I found. Wait till you see what else I... I mean, I found something this like I can't believe it. Wait until you see what I found. Hang on, sorry. So again, we're at the water's edge. University campus, Minnesota. There's, so there's the fortified wall on that side. It's a fortified city, which means it's defensed on either side of the river with huge fortified walls. And that's the one, the wall on that side. And then we just saw the wall on this side of the river. Enormous fortified terrace walls. Scooter back in action. Yes, I got pressured. I got pressured at that. I went to the car meet. I shouldn't have went to the car meet, baby. I should, not, I should have listened to my gut. And I went and I blew the clutch bell clean out of the housing, knowing donuts and wheelies. And, um, and I paid for it, so that's where I've been waiting for parts and such and doing some other things. I've been busy. Uh, where is it now? I cannot leave without this. Wait till you see this. Uh, oh my goodness. I thought it was right there. Well, I'm not gonna leave before I find it. Oh my goodness, these stamps are just so crazy. There's so many of them. And these are all damaged bricks. And there's so many different stamps, I just can't believe it. There's another Viking right there. Oh, that teacup is very creepy. Is that it? I think I see it. I think I see it. Wasn't this close? No, oh, it's over there. See what's falling off. There's huge chunks of masonry. Oh my god. Look at that. Look at that red brick mount in the tree. In the tree. A pile of brick melt. Weda. Brick melt. What's that? It's not a melted pile of melt of masonry? Are you saying it's not? Look at the red street the red inside, the brick inside swirling up. There's like swirls of red in there. What is that? It's a big pool of melt at the bottom of the of the wall. There's a huge pile of melt against the tree. I thought it was a mushroom, like these mushrooms here. Those are mushrooms. I thought that was a mushroom and it broke off as masonry. That's, are you kidding me? The bricks melted, baby. The, the bricks melted and here they are on the floor. Concrete melted too, there it is. Melted. Oh, there's my baby, there's my baby. I was getting nervous now. I was getting nervous for a moment. Okay, here's my baby. Here's my baby, you guys are gonna come home with me. And like, if, as if you can, as if you're gonna deny that these, I'll yeah, replant you right there. You can, you can still live, how about that? You can live right there. And you too. 
Hey, you two. You two can hang out right here. Okay, there. How about this? Are you kidding me? You see what this is? You see what's going on here? Look at the pillow, marshmallow. And this brick kind of snail slips down a bit. These ones are all muffed up and damaged, heat damaged, baby. And look at these bricks. They were perfect bricks, baby. Yes, they were. And look at this marshmallow Oreo stuffed melt. This Oreo stuffed mother muffin melt, baby. You give me a break if that wasn't heat damaged, baby. Now what happened to these bricks then? No, they didn't use lava rocks. These aren't lava rocks. They didn't use lava rocks to make this ugly chunk of poop. This is melt. This is the, oh, this is glass of city. It has glass in the corner of it. It's like turning into quartz glass. That one brick, this weird. These ones are just blown out, look like damaged, so. I thought that. I barely missed it too. I said, what is that in the, in the dirt? So that big chunk, that comes home. And we examine that later. That, look at that. Are you kidding me? Oh, that's weird. That red. It makes me wonder how much of that melt. I mean, how is it up against the tree? How is it up against the tree? Or oh, the tree must have displaced it. The tree must have just displaced it. The staircase right here. Huh. Okay. Okay. I don't, I don't know. Weird. Sorry, I'm, I'm kind of. I'm all over the place. Who am I? Who am I kidding? I am all over the place. I'm sorry, there's a huge wasp nest right there. And it's the size of two of my heads, baby. The two of my heads. And they're flying around it too. Yikes. That's enormous. And the heat came from the bottom up, smoking all of these bricks into one solid mass material. And the rest blocked up. Some survived right there by the pipe. So I'm surviving in the very top, in the very tippy top over there. And the rest have blocked up, smoked out into limestone. The wall is 65 feet high and there's a tapered, tapered chimney stack on top. I didn't even notice that. Oh no, that's the obelisk. There's an obelisk on top. There's an obelisk up there. I don't know if you can see it from up there, from down here. Well, you can kind of see it. Anywho. Let's go, uh, I have to get this stuff back to my car. And, uh, I'm gonna go check some more stuff out. Up river, I'm gonna go up river and see what's going on up there by the bridge. I love you all, take care. Minneapolis, Minnesota. Sorry if I'm all shaky, I didn't. I'm trying to figure that, that out because I can't keep coming to these places and doing stuff twice, you know, I keep coming coming i find something i'm like okay i want to record like right now but like i get all excited now i'm looking around it so i'm seeing stuff over here so i'm not keeping it still so i'm trying to work on that so you can see what's going on here because i can't just come look at something you know and then have to go back at the camera and then do it again i can't do that every, every time i go somewhere it takes two there is so much melt to go document i gotta keep it moving I gotta keep it moving and that's what we're gonna do. So I'm working on this. I'm trying to keep it, keep it in mind to just slow down here. So you can just, you know, do it once and keep it moving. There is something over here though I wanna look at before I, I think the metal, the metal does not rust, baby. It snapped like a, like a potato chip. Like a potato chip, it was snapped. There's all sorts of masonry rubble. Whoa. I wouldn't be surprised if that's an entrance right there. Rather, this kind of looks like a dump pile. This kind of looks like a dump pile. It kind of looks like an entrance right in the middle of this wall, don't it? It kind of does, and it's kind of void right there. Why is there a big pile of rubble right here? Loosely scattered. Oh my God.
No, it's hollow down there. It's hollow. I just heard something drop. And this is a pile. I am so stupid I didn't see that. This is the top of the this is the top of the entryway. Jeez Louise, look at me go. I am so stupid. I didn't see that this is protruding out right here. This is the entryway. There it is, the arched entryway right there, blocked up with a huge mound. I can't see it. Hold on, hang on. No, now I wanna dig. This is an entrance right here at the middle of this. this. There was an entrance right into this structure. And it's been covered up with a huge mound of, of rubble from down here. They pushed it up or something. I don't know. It's loose. And when I was when I was pulling that rock up, something fell underneath it. It, 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 it sounded like it was two feet down. I, I could hear it fall down down there. It went thunk. Listen. Did you hear it down there? Can you hear that? How far is that? Hang on, hang on. I can't see. I don't know. I don't know. Dave Wiz. Excuse me. Yeah, here's this foundation. Here's the here's the here's the entrance. Here's the entrance. It's all, there's air coming up through here. This, where's the air coming from? Where's the air coming? I feel air coming out. Oh, from over there, maybe where I just pulled that out. Oh, it's coming. Yep, yep. Just want you to know. Don't you know there's air coming out? Don't you know there's air coming out? I pulled that up and there's air coming out. Give me a break. It doesn't even smell. You gotta be kidding me. I, I love it. I can't get enough of it. They have lied. These are all mortar joints in here. Every size. The same brick. It's just cement rendering on the outside. It's, it's ash, brick ashy. Brick ashen. Brick love, everybody. Their metal does not rust. Look at this pipe. Look how big this pipe is. What is that? It doesn't rust either. And all of it, it's all, it's all damaged. Look at this, it's enormous. And there's an entrance to it right there. And they covered it up. Is there another one here on the end? I don't know what the hell this is. Oh, look at the bricks inside. Look at the bricks inside the material. Look at their joints in between. Oh, my camera does not do it justice, but this phone, I mean, but anywho. You get the idea. If you don't, stick with it. You'll get it soon enough. The bricks turn the limestone. The bricks turn the limestone. The limestone is yellow or gray. It's yellow or gray. The most abundant material found in the realm because it's melted brick and brick was the realm. The realm was a brick. It was a brick. Um, it was a brickin' world, baby. A brickin', a brickin' paradise. And what, that may have been another entrance right over there. Huh. Okie dokie. It's about the same exact height as this one here. So that might have been, I don't know. It looks more like a hole, like just kind of popped in there, but I don't, I don't know. I better get to my scooter though before I get lost. Because people people do touch stuff that's not theirs around these parts, eh? Yes, they do. They touch stuff that ain't theirs. So, this is good enough for today. Sorry, I'm looking at around that stuff. There's my piece that's coming with me. But this wall is 65 feet high. There's an obelisk up there. And these trees are cottonwoods. They're 100 feet high. And there's a plane coming from the airport on a bright blue, crisp hatchery. A quite a, a warm spring evening in the Twin Cities, Minneapolis, Minnesota. Enough talking, enough chit chat. I'll see you soon. And we're going to talk about that river down there next that river down there. I have a lot to say about that river. Some stuff I've been finding, so.